Hello everyone, this is Zero Kimchi and welcome again to Winlater 101. In this video, I'll be showing loading times comparisons between games on an SD card, local storage and the C drive in the Winlater storage. Winlater glibcc mod version 11 revision 2 was used for these tests. We will test GTA 4 and Batman Arkham Origins. Batman Arkham Origins utilizes the Unreal Engine 3. There are claims that games developed with Unreal Engine 3 load particularly fast when run from the C drive. The settings used will remain consistent across tests. Each game was run twice to minimize any inconsistencies caused by shader cache load. The SD card used is a 1TB Samsung EVO Plus U3A2B30 with 160MB per second max writing and reading speed. The device used for this test is the Ioneo Pocket S base model equipped with a 128GB UFS 3.1 internal storage. I ran some read-write tests on both the local storage and the SD card. This should provide a clearer idea of their capabilities. The parts boxed in red are tests of my local storage. The ones boxed in green are tests of my SD storage. Now that that's out of the way, let's get on with the tests. And so, we see that GTA 4 on the C drive finished first with only 2 minutes of loading time. Drive D finished second and SD card last with only roughly 20 seconds difference. Let's go test Batman next. And here we go, results are the same. In conclusion, if you encounter a game with extended loading times, I recommend placing it in the C drive within Winlater. Fortunately, based on my experience with over 50 tested games, there are not many games with prolonged loading times. At least not with glibc. However, results may vary depending on your specific device, as if all the other factors to get games to boot aren't already a hassle. <laughs> And here's a bonus, GTA 4 loading time in Winlater Prout 8.0 is a whopping 18 minutes. And another bonus, Bioshock Remastered boots if you place it in the C drive. Plus, its loading time to get in game is less than 20 seconds. Well that's it for this video, I hope this was helpful. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Make sure to like and subscribe if you liked this video. Thank you for watching, see you next time.